Hello students today we are going to discuss quick solutions for all india akash test series medical 2018 we are going to discuss test number 4 code a and i will be dealing with botany section so moving on to the first question question number 91 question number 91 says how many of the given features are associated with taxonomical key and museum respectively ab yahan par aapko kuch features de rakhe hain you have to identify which features are true for taxonomical key and which features are true for museum x situ conservation what do you understand by x situ conservation it is the conservation of organisms outside their natural habitat so this is not associated with either taxonomical key or museum okay so we have to rule this out analytical taxonomical key are analytical they have set of contrasting characters called couplet and each character in the couplet is called as lead so out of these analytical couplet and lead are associated with taxonomical key preservation of specimen if we are preserving smaller animals and plants then they are kept in formalin solution okay so preservation of specimen is done in museum and formalin is used for the preservation of specimens such as smaller animals and plants okay so out of these three features are associated with taxonomical key and two are associated with museum so by this answer to this question is option number 3 moving on to the next question that is question number 92 question number 92 says that which of the following is incorrect with respect to features of life forms you must have studied in your class about different features of life forms these can be either defining features or characteristic features defining features are those features which are exclusively present in living organism no defining feature is present in non living object talking about these features self consciousness is present in all human beings talking about these features self consciousness is present in all human beings this is correct sexual reproduction in worker honey bee worker honey bee are females what happens is at the time of birth they have sex organs but gradually on the basis of their diet these sex organs get degenerated and as at maturity they do not have sex organs so they cannot show sexual reproduction so this is an incorrect option consciousness is the feature which is shown by all living organisms this is correct and growth is a characteristic feature true because growth can be either internal or external growth internal growth is present in all living organisms so we can say that internal growth is the defining feature talking about external growth for example this is a mountain and there is deposition of ice due to the deposition of ice there is increase in size and mass of this mountain this is called external growth suppose this is a sand dune and its size increases due to accumulation of sand on it so this is a increase in size and increase in mass of this sand dune so this is an external growth external growth is shown by non living objects so if you use the term growth it is a characteristic feature this is true so by this answer to this question is option number 2 moving on to the next question that is question number 93 identify the wrong match here on the left hand side certain organisms are given to you and on the right hand side means of asexual reproduction are given ab aapko identify karna hai ki kaun sa match is incorrect okay 
protonema of mosses fragmentation this is true as in mosses asexual reproduction or vegetative reproduction occurs by fragmentation of secondary protonema planaria shows true regeneration this is true suppose this is a planaria it divides itself into fragments and each fragment develops into a new organism okay each fragment regenerates itself to form a new organism so this is true hydra show asexual reproduction called as sporulation no hydra reproduces asexually by budding this is the hydra it develops a bud a outgrowth which further develops and later on this bud detaches from the parent body and a new offspring is produced so hydra reproduces asexually by budding so its population is incorrect match bacteria show fission bacteria as we know that they are the unicellular organisms this is the nucleus then the nucleus elongates there is a division of cytoplasm as well as nucleus and two daughter bacterium are formed okay so bacteria reproduces asexually by fission so out of these four option number 3 is the incorrect match moving on to the next question that is question number 94 select the correct combination with respect to position of organisms in same kingdom ab left hand side par aapko organisms de rakhe hain and right hand side pe you are given with the kingdom and you have to check whether that particular position or that particular kingdom is correctly matched with the given organisms okay first is haeckel bacteria cara and paramecium are placed in the kingdom protista in haeckel system of classification according to haeckel bacteria and paramecium are placed in the kingdom protista whereas cara is placed in the kingdom plantae okay so this is an incorrect match second is mosses pyrogyra and nostoc are placed in kingdom protista in whittaker system according to whittaker mosses and pyrogyra are placed in plantae and nostoc which is a cyanobacterium is placed under the kingdom monera so second option is incorrect nostoc rhizobium and chlamydomonas are placed under kingdom plantae in linnaeus system of classification this is true mushroom slime mold and pink mold are placed under kingdom fungi in whittaker system of classification no in whittaker system of classification mushroom and pink mold are placed under the kingdom fungi whereas slime molds are placed under the kingdom protista so this is also incorrect so answer to this question is option number 3 moving on to the next question that is question number 95 mark the wrong statement for slime molds aap sabhi ne classes mein padha hoga that slime molds are the saprophytic protist okay ab aapko identify karna hai incorrect statement with respect to slime molds the spores of the slime mold 
possess true cellulosic cell wall. This is true that spores of the slime molds possess true cellulosic cell wall. Second, during unfavorable conditions, plasmodium differentiates and forms fruiting bodies. This is true. The spores of the slime molds are dispersed by water currents only. No, they are dispersed by air currents. So this is incorrect. Slime molds are saprophytic protist. This is correct. So out of these four, option number three is incorrect. So answer to this question is option number three. Moving on to the next question, that is question number 96. 